of course, the one and only Sky Brown. She is just so dominating. You can't take anything away from her. And she's got a positive attitude to boot. Yeah, 100%. And always got a permanent smile on. So good to see her on the course. And speaking of our contenders, we caught up with Jagger Eaton and Sky Brown earlier. No, it's my first time in Argentina. And it's such a sick place. Very beautiful. The people here are really sweet. The park's awesome. You know, the setup. I really like it. Okay, run number one and 45 seconds on the clock for our current world champion. Escape for Team GB, we have Sky Brown. Yeah, Sky is a full-blown global sensation. And wow. that's, that's why. <laughs> We've not seen that in a competition run from Sky yet. She's been holding it back. There's the alley-oop that we have seen, but that's too Powerful tricks to start it off, Chris. Yeah, yeah, the, the backflip or whatever you want to call it to start things off. That's a risky move, but somehow Sky's got it locked every time. She saved it for finals, which is smart. Yeah, the, the judges want to see different skating, even through from semifinals to our finals. And Sky is very well versed in what it takes to take that gold medal or the first place position. 100%. But down to last second Ooh, on the I back like side. That back lip lip. Side. Yes. Into the 50. So same run we saw before in the semi-finals, but changing it up with the backflip. Yeah, yeah. Adding the backflip adds quite a bit of difficulty, and she was comfortably in first place in our qualifying and quarterfinal. Quarterfinal, excuse me. So waiting for those scores to come in. 82.23 from Arissa True is the score to beat. Um, we could see a new leader coming up, Chris. Yeah, yeah. Intelligent skating there. Holding back the backflip. And boom. Showing the uh, crowd some props there, saying thank you for screaming for me. And rightly so with that kind of trick going down like the backflip that we haven't seen in the competition so far. Had Ali Bear into the hip. And then we see that backflip tweaking it out. Yeah, kicking that back foot out. Tailboned. Yeah. We can call it a rodeo. Nice Madonna there. Keeping her speed throughout the park. That's really key. Yeah, and you can see just bonking those back wheels off the coping, getting that board to stay on the feet as you grab hold of it, take it through into the deep end, and check out that stale Ooh. fish. Knee on board, proper execution there, and uh, boosting way out of the coping, Chris. Right, now, yeah, uh, Sky Brown is seriously a force to be reckoned with. Dad's hiding. Woo! Oh, 85.22 and your new leader. That's going to be a tough one to beat, but it's not over yet. We're taking it back to the top of the heat uh, where we started with runs number two. Down now. So now Sky has seen that gap has been closed massively. Going to need to step it up once again. Here's run number two for Sky Brown. There's that backflip every single time, tweaks it out. And the big alley-oop, scooping that one round. Front side nose grind, so changing the run up, yeah, Chris. Yeah, I like it, adding that stand nose grind. Well executed. And Sky qualifying so high in our semi-finals means that she gets the luxury of watching everyone else's run and knowing what she needs to do to be able to beat the run before or the next one down below her. Great combination of tricks in the deep end there. Showing her, her vert versatility. That one's going to be out of time, but phenomenal run there again from Sky Brown. Are we going to be looking at a small increase? What do you think, Chris? Ah, oh, man, that's tough to say. I think uh, it was... I, I'd say maybe sticks around the same with the 85, maybe cracks the N86. So here's those replays from run number two for Sky Brown. Starting it off with the alley oop, and there's the backflip. So chilled on that every go, Chris. Yeah, she's got that trick on lock. You see a big Madonna. Scooping that backside air and bouncing those wheels off the coping. Yeah, and she put on a clinic in the deep end. 
Sky is in yeah. first after her first run. So waiting for that score to come in for run number two for Sky Brown. Already got 85.22 for run number one. Wow. 87.45. Going to be really happy. That gap just got blown <laughs> away. That's going to be so hard to beat, Chris. Yeah, I love it. I mean, I guess the judges rewarded her for switching up the line, taking some risks. Yeah, I love to see the family support out here popping up at all the contests, and killing it. So, our final rider of our women's finals here at the World Skateboarding Tour. First stop, San Juan, Argentina. This is a, what we call a victory lap. Yeah, already won this thing, but Sky usually puts on a good show, so let's see what she's got. Kicking it off oh, with the backflip. Like I like it. She's going with a complete line, it looks like. Alley oop backside air. Front nose grind. See the adjustment there at the back foot to nolly that one in. Yeah, she's just competing with herself at this point. Kick flipping that kick to the deep end. We oh could see that Lord. score gain even further, Chris. Backside tail slide. Kick turning it round. That's going to affect him. But there's the Madonna getting the speed back in. Alley oop onto the bank. This has got the variation, Chris. Three seconds on the clock. Yes, yes. Uh, and the that's going to be time for Sky Brown. Yes. Amazing skateboarding there. Again and again, we saw her take. The gold medal at our World Championships in Sharjah a few months ago. And Sky Brown is looking unstoppable as we move on to our World Skateboarding Tour 2023. There you have it. First place, 87.45 score so far. Will we see an improvement, Chris? Uh, I'd say slight improvement, but yeah, it's, it's hard to say. 87.45 is up there. So top three there, Sky Brown. Yeah, that was just a personal best for her. She didn't need that run at all. Did it for the crowd and the love. Great tuck knee on that backflip. And then, not sure if that counted. We'll see on the score. The commitment was there to do the trick. There's that big stale fish air in the deep end. Yeah, you mentioned during quarterfinals, we think that once you're up on to the transition, you get to complete the trick. Whoa! 19.84, are you kidding me? I think the judges got tipped over the edge there with the kickflip Indy through into the deep end, Chris. Yeah, every run got more and more difficult. And she put together three perfect runs. And you know what? That looked pretty chill for Sky there. Plenty more gas in the tank, I think. And it's going to be interesting as we move forward with our World Skateboarding Tour 2023 to see that progression go through in our women's skateboarding. So, eighth place, Lily Stofasia. Seventh, Arissa True. Sixth place, Dora Pereira. Fifth place, Kokona Haraki. Fourth place, Hinano Kusaki. And our top three, 85.17 for Rika Oliveira. Second place, we have 86.16, Ruby True. And first place goes to Great Britain's 90.84, Sky Brown. Yeah, I love the global diversity there. Great Britain, Australia, Brazil, Japan, Germany. It's a new era of skateboarding. Yes, yeah, so, so good. What a phenomenal final. And it's time to take it down to the platform to Sam Bruce with our first place of our finals, Sky Brown. Sky, our new number one champion. Congratulations. So obviously you're the world champion in Sharjah and now first place here. Tell us what is going through your head at the moment. God, I am so, so stoked. Um, it was so cool watching all the girls just push it to another level. I mean, we were all in the 80s, and it's just so cool to see so inspiring and makes you want to push even harder. And yeah, I just had the best time with all my friends, and yeah, I'm going to miss this. And like you said, so now you actually got 90 in your run. Again, that was amazing. What went through your head as soon as you saw that score come through? God, um, 
I, yeah, my run was very sketchy. My last run in Dubai, it was sketchy too, so <laughs> pretty funny, but yeah, it was definitely stoked to get in the 90s. Um, I know, yeah, so it's... Great, thank you so much for that, and congratulations again. See you at the next stop. Sky Brown there, all smiles. And you can see the emotion coming out of there, taking the world champs earlier in the year and coming through with first place here at the first stop of our World Skateboarding Tour.